Oh yeah. So welcome to the video. We're back in Epic Roller Coasters. I haven't played this game since I bought my original Quest. Quest 2 even. Whee! But it seems it's been upgraded. Welcome to Epic Roller Coasters. The place where you will travel different worlds feeling the adrenaline and velocity of the craziest rails you have ever seen. Our experiences can be very intense. So can I help you find the perfect comfort level? Yeah, why not? So this never used to be here. You used to just land in a hub. And you could change the settings. You could put like a helmet on to avoid motion sickness and things. Um, and I think you could purchase different DLCs with different roller coasters on them. So there was dinosaurs and sort of uh, there was a Christmas one and there was one in like a space station or something, I think. Um, and then you got different modes as well. There was ones where you could just ride the roller coaster. There was ones where you could shoot targets, uh, which was pretty fun. Um, but there's been an upgrade. And I've noticed that on the thumbnail now is SpongeBob. And I really want to try a SpongeBob themed roller coaster so that's why i'm hopping in today uh so let's see if they can find the perfect comfort oh. level i'm going to put a helmet with a blinder on you and at any sign of motion sickness you should look straight forward push the safety bar to start the ride oh, i i don't want this on i want it off right, I've, I've done that Woo. here we go can i take off the blinder Whee. It's definitely a game that you want to sit down while you're playing, which works out well. There we go. I think that's just to test your, your motion sickness level. Woo! See? That's how it's done. A good adrenaline dose. How are you feeling? I'm fine. Cool. Let's try another roller coaster then. Yeah, I think I think I'll exit the tutorial. Um, if it's your first time playing the roller coaster game, then I suggest you do it. And I guess it'll customize the experience based on how you feel in different intensities. Oh, this looks cool. Hey, it's Patrick. There's SpongeBob. <laughs> Squidward. Just crabs. Oh, this looks awesome. Ride through the incredible world of SpongeBob SquarePants, riding five roller coasters that will take you inside Bikini Bottom. Of course I want to do that. Okay, so I've downloaded the SpongeBob SquarePants DLC. So we've got five different roller coasters here. So we've got Glove World, Expresso, Mr. Krabby Paddy, Sunday at Goo Lagoon, Ghost Coaster, and Snow Slide. So we'll start with the first one. Glove World Expo, Expresso. Help SpongeBob SquarePants and Patrick collect tickets to end Glovey Plushy. And we're on classic mode at the minute. Let's go. Hey, here we go. I love SpongeBob SquarePants, I think it's hilarious. Are you ready? Pull it down. I have turned my haptic, haptic suit on, but it doesn't seem to recognize them for some reason. Right, so press the trigger to open selfie. And press the button to take a photo. Selfie! This is pretty cool. Am I supposed to be doing anything? You alright? Go and get that open. Do we need to collect any of these? Ah, super cool. Like stepping into SpongeBob's planet. Bikini bottom. Not a planet. Oh, it's going fast now. Oy. Good thing to sit down in these games. Can I steal someone's glove? Whoa, whoa, Patrick. You're gonna get yourself run over there. Hey, look at SpongeBob. I'm gonna try one of these on the uh, shooting mode. On target. I'll do that in the next one so I'm not just sat here. Oh, got two photos now. Two selfie sticks. Oh, gosh. They look like they're having an amazing time. You can actually play these multiplayer as well. So if you have a friend, you can pull them into your cart as well. <laughs> oh. Nice and intense. Can I steer or is it going to do it by itself? There's SpongeBob again. How is he getting so far ahead of me? Hello. Oh, 
god, did they drop? Ugh. Oh, nice hit. Nicely aligned. Ugh. I don't know what that goo is that's sticking the rails to the floor. Hey! He's everywhere, SpongeBob. Fiery fist of pain. Am I supposed to? Nope. Oh. <laughs> you can extend it as far out as you need to. And then all your photos go to like a gallery. And you can export them. Here we go, we're really high up now. I'm gonna plumb it back down. Wee! Oh, heck. Oh my goodness, got a little bit more sinister and dangerous than I would have thought. Ooh. This doesn't look very friendly. Oh, heck. This is like something from. I expect you to die. Some of Dr. Evil would set up. Where are we going now? I thought we were coming out of the water. Hey! There's a little island. Whoop! Straight back under. Into the deep. Lots of mines. Oh, 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 oh. Did we win? Yay! Well done, guys. So let's now go to my Krabby Paddy. But we're going to do it on the shooter mode. So let's see what this is all about. Okay, so shooter mode, you get different types of guns. And you're going to hit targets as, as the roller coaster goes along. And obviously, the more accurate you are, more points you get. So it just adds another element to it, gives the roller coaster a bit more depth. And you can slow it down by holding the grip buttons. And then speed it back up by way by letting go. We're using like some sort of slingshot gun. Oh it's a Krabby Patty gun. Oh, all the points. Oh yeah, don't need to slow it down. Maybe I do. <laughs> Can I kill a jellyfish? No, you lose points for killing a jellyfish. Let's go. Back down. Hey, I haven't even been checking out the environment because why because I was trying to hit the targets so it's usually a good idea to try it without the targets first and then sort of understand the level yeah I'm not doing too bad though yeah I love the slow motion mode. Although it does feel a little bit like cheap. Yes, come on. I've got that one. I'll tell you what, these sponge ones are really bright and vibrant, as you would expect. Kids will love it, and I'm just a big kid, really. I love the sound effect that it's hitting the metal drums. Come on, shoot these crabby, crabby guns. Hey, get off! You're gonna get yourself hurt. I haven't collected any collectibles. I didn't know. I don't know what the collectibles are. What 
going to collect those. How does one collect them? Oi. Whew. So even though I don't get motion sickness, it is a roller coaster. So sometimes some of the loops do get a bit intense. So that's where the helmet comes in handy if you if you want to use that. There we go. Finish. Ah, we landed at the Krabby Patty. Let's try the Ghost Coaster. Shooter mode. And then I'll do the snow one on the race. Seems a bit more fitting. Welcome to Ghost Coaster. Ooh, look at these guns. It's got, uh, what's the buddy called? David Jones, is it? Forget what the Ghost Pirate's called. Got here. This one doesn't look too bad. Like, whoa, targets everywhere now. Had to do slow motion there. There's just targets everywhere. Walk off something. I mean, it's not scary, but I guess it's not meant to be. It's just meant to be. Spooky. Oh, it's got spooky. I'm having to double up on uh, on some of these targets just because I'm afraid of missing. Oh! I, can't, I forgot what he called it. It's like David Jones. I feel like I've missed all of them. Oh. Ah, here we go. A little bit more spooky now. Everything's scary in the dark. Including me. Oh. There he is, David Jones. The Flying Dutchman. That's what he's called. Not David Jones. The Flying Dutchman. I think. Hey, oh, I lost points for shooting him. Poor thing, I'm terrified. That was a spooky noise. Yeah. That was poorly timed. Oh! Whoa! Swallowed me up. Sometimes you really have to use that slow motion. You just don't have, uh, just don't have enough reaction time at all. Or it's got you at a funny angle. I mean, I'm missing loads here. I should, do, I should do the whole thing in slow motion. It's been a while, to be fair, since I played. Sorry. Go away. You're in my way. Can't see. Well, that was unexpected. You saw sandy cheeks. Go away. These roller coasters are awesome. I think it was like, I think if you look at the DLC, it's about seven pound and you get all five. Which isn't bad, to be honest. I'm sure the base game's free for the DLC. Not too bad at all. We'll do snow slide as a race. Here we go. Right, I can't for the life of me remember. I think grip is slow down and uh, trigger speed up so here we go this one isn't even on a roller coaster so how does one go off the track it looks fun regardless let's go as fast as we can get away could have collected that checkpoint I don't understand did I fail 
I don't know what happened there. Or it's got a collectible. What's going on? Let's go slow, see what happens. Yeah, maybe I was going too fast for this area because it's all curved. Ah, yeah, there's like a caution symbol coming. Oh, nice jump. Let me slow down a little bit. Yeah, so this one's just about controlling your speed. You can see it wobbling on the little map. And if it gets too out of control, that's when you die, I think. So we can probably speed up a little bit here. Because we want to get a good time. Now, nah, lost it. Right, slow down. Hit a really big curve. Right, now we can probably speed up. Ah. We need to build speed at this point. Otherwise, we're not going to make the jump. See, on the actual roller coaster ones with the tracks, it's easier to gauge whether you're going to be off track or not. Oh, I nearly made it. Because with this one, I'm basically just using the map and some common sense. Right, speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up. Oh, come on, I did it that time. Game's lying to me. I'm trying to not use the brake. I'm just going to let it naturally glide until I'm ready to speed up now. Yeah, this is it. Got it. Brake a little bit here. Oh, see, so it tried to kill me there. And there. I was thinking I was going to die. So I pulled it out of the hat last minute. Almost at the finish line. We want to break here. It's a nice snowy mission. This one's nice and different to what you normally get in this game. Got another collectible. That's six. Alright, I think we're at the home straight. No. I didn't want me to go that fast. Oh, come on. I was right at the end. Come on. We've got this. Right in the home straight. Well, maybe not yet. There's nothing straight about this bloody course. I'm just going to let it glide, my hands behind my head, and just hope. <laughs> Go on, you can do it. Go on, son. Oh no, I might be going a bit too fast. Oh no? No? I think we've got it. Yes! Pow, pow, pow. Even got the collectible at the end. Two minutes, twenty seconds though. I tell you what, I will show you the last one, which is Sunday at Goolagoon, and we'll just do... Actually, we'll, we'll do Shooter on this one. I like Shooter. So this will be the last one of the five. No! Come on then, let's go. Last one. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, I know you can slow watch. But I've been telling everyone that. This one's nice, I like the bubble gun noises. Hey Spongebob, why do I keep doing that one? Why were they looking so angry and scared? Yeah, oh no, I keep taking points off myself. But they're just so shootable. Have I stuck it? Yeah, I stuck it in slow motion, I don't know how I did that. Whoa, whoa. Ah, can't resist shooting these guys. Got a collectible. What's all about when I collect it? Are they burying a dead body? These levels are fantastic. Another collectible. I'm not even bothered about shooting these normal things. I'm looking for secrets. Easter eggs. Got it in the end. Oh. Oh look, the terrifying squid with that. Don't know what I'm gonna do. We saw them burying a body earlier on. 
think they've already killed Mr. Krabs. They'll come after Squidward. Right, not doing too good. I have to pull it back with some slow motion. Pull it back with a slow mo. Got a two for one there. God, he's everywhere. Hey, come on. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Zorbin and yellow and porous as he. Please don't copyright me. Right, where? <laughs> it's too many loops. I like Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to get top of the leaderboard for this lane. Although, I, if I tried a couple of times, maybe. Maybe. But if I did the slow motion. But I'm just trying to, like, go through it. I'm conscious that I'm doing, like, five roller coasters in one video. <laughs> Is it? A special. Got it. Alright, Patrick. Come on. But uh, yeah, I love these environments. I love these roller coasters. But if you haven't tried this game, do try the uh, T Rex one. It's absolutely fantastic. All of the dinosaurs. It's, uh, it's like being in a, in a Jurassic Park movie. though, why they chose Spongebob as a DLC. I mean, I'm not upset about it, because I think it's amazing I love Spongebob. But I wonder where the idea to bring Spongebob into came from. So we'll speak, yeah, we're near the end. Oi. Boom. Boom. Good, good, run. Run for your life. Patrick's coming to kill you. Oh. Why are they being so creepy towards Squidward? There's a lot of upside down loops on this one. I'm having trouble keeping up with it. Not doing too bad here. He says, and then this is like 12 shots in a row. I'm better off when I use one hand instead of two hands. Yes! Right, there we go. That is maybe later. Back to the lobby. Right, so that's the SpongeBob DLC in Epic Roller Coasters. It's a shame my uh, haptics didn't work. I'm not sure why. I'll have to investigate that. But yeah, that's uh, really cool. I enjoyed that. So, check it out if you've got Epic Roller Coasters. Uh, SpongeBob SquarePants DLC. If you haven't tried it, base game's free if you want to give it a try on the MetaQuest store. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye!